Gateway 31 Storm Tracker Meteorologist Amber Kulin with 31 Triple Doppler. Amber, everybody that I talk to, they're like, it is just so miserable outside. Mm -hmm. We're trying to plan everything we can do inside. But the big question is, how long will these extreme temperatures last? The good news is only a few more days. Oh. Okay. And then the rain will move in, will cool off a little bit. So this is just Mother Nature reminding us after the 80s that we had the past oh, couple that of weeks true. that summer's not over yet. We did get spoiled. We did. Yeah, we right. did. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and take a look outside right now on our Wait 31 Sky Cam Network powered by Thompson Roofing and Construction. A beautiful day across the Tennessee Valley, but it's a warm one. Temperatures are warming up as we speak, and they will continue to warm through the afternoon hours today. Not a cloud in sight across the area and temperature wise most of us already in the 90s where we do have those temperature readings we are missing a few it's 91 right now in Huntsville 91 in Decatur 90 in Moulton and 92 degrees in Muscle Shoals but we're going to continue to warm through the rest of the afternoon and over in Sand Mountain we're looking at those middle to even upper 90s in some of the area 99 today in Scottsboro 92 in Rainsville 93 in Fort Payne 95 in Skyline this afternoon 98 degrees in Huntsville, 95 up towards Meridianville and Hazel Green, 97 in Faultful and even Decatur this afternoon. Over in the Shoals, though, you may hit that 100 degree mark from Florence to Russellville, even Cherokee this afternoon. Tomorrow, even warmer than today. So make sure that you are taking care of yourself. We told you about this heat last week, and here we are. 100 degrees for your high on Wednesday, 98 on Thursday. But by Thursday, we will start to see the humidity come up a little bit. So even though the air temperature will be 98 degrees, it's going to feel like those triple digits across the area. The heat starts to back off a little bit as we head towards the weekend, and that's when we'll start to see those rain chances back in the forecast as well. But right now, 31 triple Doppler, quiet and dry across the Tennessee Valley. That's how we'll stay through the rest of the day today and for the entire state of Alabama. Things are quiet this afternoon. So here's what we're looking at as we move through the rest of your Tuesday. A few clouds here or there, but mostly sunny skies the rest of the afternoon hours. Quiet to start you off on your Wednesday morning, Wednesday afternoon. We'll see a few clouds here or there. I do think most of us will end up staying dry tomorrow. But as we work into Thursday, that's when we'll start to see those rain chances back in the forecast. Quiet to start you off Thursday morning, but by Thursday afternoon with the peak heating of the day, and that humidity back into the air, that's when we'll start to see those rain chances go up a little bit. And rain chances will continue to go up as we head towards your weekend as well. And I know it's Labor Day weekend, so let's go ahead and time it out for you. By Friday afternoon, isolated to scattered showers and a few storms possible. And we're going to repeat this all over again on Saturday, then again on your Sunday as well. Even into Monday, we could see that chance of rain across the Tennessee Valley. So download that Storm Tracker weather app to keep updated. Keeping an eye on the Atlantic as well. It's been quiet over the past couple of weeks, but over the next seven days, a 20% chance that we could see something develop in that main developed region. But here at home, though, temperatures staying warm over the next couple of days. Rain chances back into the forecast as we head towards the weekend. And along with those rain chances, we will start to see those temperatures back down as well back into the 80s by next week. So relief, it's on the way. Ooh, I like it. We just have to be patient. Exactly. That's it. Oh, okay, got <laughs> it. Thank you so much, Amber. Uh -huh.